Time to know the top stories of the day. I am Jenny Arado. This is News Bits Tonight. The office of the city building official has given the management of Magallanes residences five days to vacate the building effective Friday, January 17. Rob Gumba has the details. In the letter, OCBO head Serena Grace Katubig ordered all occupants of the Toledo building of the Magallanes residences to vacate after the building was deemed unsafe for occupancy. Katubig said major structural cracks on the beams and slabs were observed during an inspection conducted on Friday, January 17. The inspection was conducted by OCBO. City Engineer's Office, the Philippine Institute of Civil Engineers Davao, and Association of Structural Engineers of the Philippines Davao, following the December 15, 2019 earthquake that struck the city. The building's management is also required to submit the structural test result, computation or calculation, and the comprehensive structural plan for rectification or retrofitting methods on the beams and slabs signed and sealed by their civil and structural engineer. The official also cited provisions of Presidential Decree 1096 or the National Building Code of the Philippines, wherein building officials are required to order to vacate, repair, or demolish any building or structure found or declared to be dangerous for occupancy. Sunstar Davao tried to get the site of Magallanes residences, but there was no reply as of Monday, January 20. DHSUD Davao Region Officer in Charge Miguel Palmahil said these condominiums were declared to have been affected by the earthquakes based on OCBOS assessment. Rob Gumba, Newsbits Tonight. A dog was traumatized after it was molested by a male boarder in Barangay 13, Davao City. Juliet Revita for the story. The incident went viral on Facebook after the dog owner, who goes by the Facebook name Ren Ren, posted what happened to their dog named Igit on Sunday, January 19, 2020. Ren Ren narrated in his post that because Igit is a friendly dog, he went with the male boarder of their neighbor who carried it to an abandoned building nearby. Because the dog had not been back for a while, his sibling went looking for the dog. But it came as a great shock to the sibling when the male boarder was already naked and molesting the dog. In a phone interview with Super Balita Davao, Mary Grace Dalilan, mother of Ren Ren said, the dog has since been scared of approaching other people after the incident. Dalilan added that after what happened, they have not seen the male border yet. Sexual attraction to an animal is called zoophilia. As defined in Britannica.com, this condition may involve the experience of sexual fantasies about the animal or the pursuit of real sexual contact with it. Julia Trivita, Newsbeats Tonight. To check more stories, visit our website www.sunstar.com.ph slash Davao. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on our social media accounts on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. You can also grab a copy of Sunstar Davao at Davao Central Convenience Stores, 7-Eleven, and nearest news outlets. And that's all you need to know for tonight. Good evening.